Hello everyone, Will again here. So it's a really exciting day today because we are actually getting the wrapper out for the first time. For those of you that didn't know, we have purchased a wrapper standard 10 uh, or series 10 um, mobile handling system. If you haven't seen all the stuff about it already, pop over to the video before this one and check that out. But really exciting times today, guys, just because we're gonna be using the wrapper to help about the use. So if you did enjoy the video today, guys, or sorry, if you do enjoy the video today, guys, please give it a massive like. You'll see loads more stuff like this, loads more sheep farming, loads more halogy stuff. Just smash that subscribe button. And don't forget, guys, videos every Wednesday and Saturday at half seven in the morning. Cheers, guys, we'll see you later. Hi everyone, so we're now down at the sheep and as you can probably see the old handling system is still up so the plan is we're going to attach this to the front of it and use it to handle the sheep because it should be a lot better than the one we were using before, so the richer one. So the plan is this go on the front so we're going to pop 10 hurdles down here, 10 down that, make a forcing pen at the front, then a dosing race and then we'll have the basically the main bit of the system at the front. So I've just got to get used to it because I, yeah. It should be about uh, 70 foot that way, which obviously we're all closer than 70 foot at the moment. So just got to figure it out, not used it before. So we'll see how we get on. Should be a really good day.
so guys that is the wrapper all set up so as you can probably see from above from all those drone shots what i've done is i set all the hurdles out first because i wasn't too sure how far they'd come this way because i haven't used it before i know it's a bit backwards and not really the way around you should do it but in future i'll be able to figure it out a bit better so basically we've got this is the main body of the wrapper here we're taking the wheel off so the plan is we're gonna head to back all the lambs in this bit get all of them in and then pull those hurdles round so we've obviously got the big pen of the handling system that's all um, set up already uh, we don't really need it but I thought I may as well leave it because it's just going to make things easier so yeah basically I'm going to run them in pull those hurdles around there over to there then we're going to push them up so as Mark said in the last video you have them in the big pen at the back here so then you push them into this smaller pushing up pen so pin comes out comes comes around and then the sheet obviously in this big pen push up here then the gate closes behind me so that would be the gate close then you keep pushing them into here to be um, heptavactin out the side so what I've done so I don't have to dismantle it fully is we're just taking the wheel off we have taken the winch off so basically when they're done they'll come into here that'll come off like that and they'll come out the side door so that should make things a bit easier. I might even take that side door off because I think they'll run better. But that is the plan. But this morning I'm actually working for Flames. So what you know, I work for Flame Marketing. So I've got five hours there. And me and Ed, everyone knows Ed. Coming back later, head to back and these shouldn't take too long using this new wrapper system. Obviously we're not used it before, so we're not going to be rapid. It did take me longer than it normally would. So I used to use one of these on placement. It took a bit longer than I expected to set up, but once we get used to it, it should only take us like 10 minutes to set up in the future. So can't wait to get using it. Um, yeah, guys, I will see you in a bit. So guys, it is afternoon now. So we've come back. We're going to head to the sheep and see how the wrapper gets on. I've got Ed here to help me today. So Ed's been away for a month and he's finished at uni now. Well, you finished Friday, don't you? Yeah, I finished Friday. Yeah, so that's us done. We're going to get these in might try and use the drone to get them in because there's only two of us rather than we always three but that's the plan so pop the drone up so you can see it and i'll chat to you once the sheep are in Right, so that went pretty much the plan, apart from when the cade lambs that are obviously in with the lambs now decided to turn around and didn't want to go in. So we've got all the using and mo well, pretty much 95% of the using lambs in. So now we're going to push all the cades in. Hopefully they go in all right. Fingers crossed, but we all know what cade lambs are like. Come on, cadies. Follow your step mums. <whistles> I'll grab that end again, Ed. Go on. That's it. If you pull that round, and then obviously just wait there, Ed, until she's gone past. That's it. That's it. Up. Right, so that is all the cades in, so they went in a lot easier second time. You can just see by that little bit of clip there, they're so much easier to push around and there's a lot more flow. So we've got them in here, so the plan is we're going to get sheep into this one and just keep them flowing going through the system. So obviously we're hepped back in today, which is a vaccine. I'll talk a little bit about it, but the main thing obviously 
is going through the wrappers so that's the plan we're going to push a few more sheep in now and then we'll get vaccinated Go on, up, 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 up. Up, 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 go on, girls. Up, go on. That'll do it. Right guys, I have just had to stop the video there because I am actually in disbelief how quick we are doing these ewes and lambs. Normally, like all these have already been done, we've been going like half an hour and we're over halfway through. 40 well, yeah. 40 minutes we've been going. These are all ready to go, they're done, so we're through half the sheep. I'm just in disbelief how efficient this is. They literally flow so well through the system. They've opened this up here so they can go through. I just can't believe how good this is if I'm honest well worth the money right guys just to prove how efficient it is basically what i found out these hurdles are really easy to hop over and get in so this is designed as mark said in the last video 33 inches wide so basically a width of the you and a lamp so it means that i can also weave my way through it really well whereas you know with some races they're a bit narrow and you struggle to get through them so it just makes it so much quicker to get the job done like literally, end time the last one took 59 seconds to do about 20 laps because you can literally just walk, work your way through them so quickly. Like literally, I'll go now, like literally, you do one, pop it behind you, you go to the next one, and you just work your way through them, it's so easy. Like, well, it's just mad, really mad. I can't believe it. It's more helpful, isn't it, Will? Yeah, yeah, definitely. Obviously, I'm not doing it with the U, so... But I'm just working my way through these. As I talk to you, it's just make it so much easier. All right, you can just weave your way through them because of the space. I know, oh, I've done that, mate. Go on, you. So, three here at the end. There. Hey, calm down. There. And there. Right guys, so that is all the lambs heptavac, so it literally took us just under an hour, which is mad really, to do 200 lambs, probably normal for most people, but for me that's quick. So what we're going to do now is pack up, and then I'll give you an opinion on the wrapper for the first time you use it. So we'll get this wrapped up, <laughs> pardon the punt, and then we'll get, um, then I'll have a chat with you. Right guys, so that is the wrapper all packed up, so it got packed away really quickly, a lot quicker than what it did, and point it out. I, obviously it's the first time we've used it we'll get quicker every time we are very impressed with this bit of kit 
I didn't actually think it would save us that much time. I thought it'd be a lot easier to set up and be a lot more efficient pushing the lambs and um, you through. But it has saved us so much time. Just got to move that. But that's because it's actually turned a three hour job into an hour and a half. So it's half the time. Obviously pushing the sheep through was a lot quicker. But you got to pack it up and take it back. So that slows it down a little bit. But the actual job itself, it is so quick. And this bit of kit here, I'm impressed with. And we'll be using it a lot over the next coming years. Hopefully it lasts really long. Fingers crossed. Should do. I know someone's had one 20 years. So it's... um built really well all aluminium by the way if you want to know more about it watch the video we did with mark the other day from rapper he'll give you all the details but today was more about the first time using it really impressed i'll keep saying that but yeah if you did enjoy it today guys please give the video a massive like if you want to see more stuff like this please smash that subscribe button and don't forget videos every wednesday and saturday at half seven in the morning and i'll see you next time guys with something different cheers bye